Heavy fuel oil is the predominant oil burnt in the Arctic, in fact burnt globally. It's so heavy that it's like tar and it, it just its lifespan is just years and years and years. And it has two types of impacts. If it's spilled, it has a devastating impact on the local economies, on the wildlife, on the ecosystem generally. It takes out the natural resources that the local indigenous communities are dependent upon. And then the other impact is when you burn it, and it burns dirty. It's highly viscous, and when combusted to generate the power to propel vessels generates uh, enormous quantities of uh, highly toxic gases. When you burn heavy fuel oil you get high emissions of black carbon. When it settles on the ice it diminishes its uh, reflecting properties and any petroleum byproduct like that when the sun hits the carbon pollution it heats it up which translates to melting the ice faster. Any oil spill in the Arctic would obviously be devastating. Of course, they're more likely to have an accident up there because it's a, quite a hazardous environment with all the sea ice around, unlike other oceans. And there is almost no resources, especially for bigger ships further offshore, to be cleaned up. Heavy fuel oil, because of the colder water, it is going to stay around for probably months, even years. But what we need to happen is a clear-cut decision that we're going to ban its use in the Arctic and to move that forward as rapidly as possible.